everyone, how's it growing? This is your garden teacher, Miss Sammy, and today I am here at Hollister Elementary School. I want to show you all what's been growing since you've been gone and take you on a little tour. The garden really misses you and I miss having you here, so I thought I would take a moment and bring it to you guys. All right, let's check it out. Here's our cactus that's blooming, has some gorgeous flowers. Over here we have two garden beds. This one on the left is a whole bunch of things. I like to plant really fragrant uh, things in here because there are gophers that like to come in, but the gophers don't like to eat things such as marigolds. Um, this is catnip, there's sage. Here's some lemon balm. So all of those are very fragrant, which deters the gophers. You can also see here we have some shallots that are ready, um, almost ready to harvest and some lettuce that is ready to harvest. There's also a squash plant right here. Over on this side, we have some kale and these are calendula. There's a baby bunny right there. I don't know if you can see it. It is so cute. Here we have some cilantro looking good. There's also a bit of dill in here. Our passion fruit vine is looking extremely happy right now. It just needs a little bit of trellising. But check it out. We have some little baby passion fruits that are already starting to grow. These are one of my favorite fruits. I can't wait. A few months ago, um, during our work party, some parents built these awesome new garden beds. And over the past couple months, I've been working to install irrigation and plant some seeds. And finally, things are starting to grow back here. So I'm very excited to show you. Over here, we have some strawberry plants on the left side. You can see the strawberries are starting to grow. There's a little green one. Over here in the middle are some bush beans and a couple sunflowers. That's a little sunflower sprout. And here on the end are snap peas. So it is gonna get a bit crowded in here, so I'll have to uh, transplant some of these beans to another area, but it's looking awesome. Over in this bed, I put a few pumpkin plants. They look like this. Here's a tomato and a pepper plant. I also put carrot seeds in here, but they have not totally come up yet. And lastly, this garden bed has some radishes that are looking really good. Let's see if we can... There it is. There's our little radish. We also have more tomatoes and peppers that were put in here very recently. On the end, we have some young beets and chard over in the back row. Here's one of our pomegranate trees looking incredible. There are just so many blossoms on here. I have a good feeling we're gonna get some sweet pomegranates this year. Over here, our pineapple guava tree also has a whole bunch of blossoms. I know all of you kids love the pineapple guava. I can't wait for you to be back so you can help me eat all of them. Over here are, this is a tiger fig tree. Looking good, the leaves look happy. I love these leaves, they're giant. And our black fig tree already has some figs forming. Check it out. Looking pretty big, but definitely not ripe yet. All right, I hope this video was a reminder to you to go get outside, do some exploring, maybe do some gardening. Um, I'll be posting videos every so often so that you guys can still feel connected to the garden and motivated to get outside yourself. Alrighty, stay safe everyone.